Hello my lovely Sophia here. Welcome to my channel Sophia Psychic Tarot. Today's daily message is for the 7th of April 2022. We have the three paths 1, 2 and 3 with the birthday message if it is your birthday today and the timestamps are in the description box below the video. For my lovelies who chose par number one, let's have a look at your message today. Okay, this is very specific for a reconciliation. So always remember that with any of the, the piles on any of the days, if they don't seem to, you know, you don't relate to them, then you can always choose another pile. Sometimes if you are choosing it first thing in the morning, you're not sure how your day is going to unfold anyway. <laughs> I know I've picked piles um, out of fun and thought, well, that doesn't relate. And then late at the end of the day, I can say, oh, yeah, well, that did happen. Not always, must admit. It's just like with your horoscope. You pick up your horoscope and, you know, it fits or it doesn't put it that way. It's just for fun. But this pile, if you are not waiting for anybody to come back into your life, then this is not the pile for you because this is definitely somebody coming forward here. So we've got your person, whether they are male or female passionate about you, wanting to be with you, with this lion, perhaps having the strength, courage and confidence to come forward to you. Um, reconciliation, someone from your past is returning and we have work through your fears. Now it may be that um, they come back and you are fearful of it falling apart again or going in the same cycle, then work through those fears. Um, if you are waiting for somebody to come back, but you've still got fears and doubts attached to it, then work through them so that they can come in because your person is ready to come in, but your energy may be repelling energy because you're fearful or you're going over the old story and keeping sort of that time delay happening here. Um, but either way, somebody is wanting to reach out to you here. So I will leave that with you, my lovelies, a love and light. For my lovelies who chose pile number two, let's have a look at your message today. <laughs> I like the colours match on there. Right, okay, so we have the end of a tough cycle approaches. We have victory and success or being acknowledged. She's under the spotlight. So, you know, we have the victory wreath. It could be that you are recognised for something that you've been putting hard work into. Um, and the end of the tough cycle um, approaches and also it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all well look at her really opening herself up to receive here you know this sign you know the this v shape is what a lot of people do in meditations to receive from the universe what it is that they want so by opening your heart um, to give and receive the highest energy of all, you are letting that victory and success come to you as well. In whatever area of your life that one is, I will leave that with you, love and light. For my lovelies who chose pile number three, let's have a look at your message today. Okay, so we have you planting your seeds, waiting for it to grow. We have have faith in your dreams and we have let go of control issues, allow this situation to unfold naturally. So every desire or want that you have is a seed that you plant. And if you water it with positivity, with um, that knowing that what you want, having faith in your dreams that they will grow, they will. OK, but if you doubt and you are fearful then or you are impatient and you keep digging that seed up and you're breaking the roots okay then you're causing a time delay so spirit is saying your seed is planted if you have planted it correctly in the faith that it's going to grow um funny how it's another load of plants there um let go of the controlling it okay you don't need to worry about the how and the when just have faith that it will come okay let it unfold naturally let it grow naturally okay instead of digging that seed up worrying and being impatient if you like i will leave that with you have a wonderful day love and light for those of you who have a birthday today happy birthday my lovelies we have find your center your outside world is a reflection and a manifestation of what's going on inside you at this time. 
when the outside world becomes so hectic and stressful that your anxiety starts to overwhelm you, then this is an ideal moment to stop and ask, when was the last time I checked in with myself? So if your outside world is a reflection of your inner world and you're not liking what you see in the outside world in any area of your life, then what this card is saying is go back in and check with your feelings or with your thoughts to see where they are in relation to the thing that you're not liking. So if it is a person, you're not liking what they're doing or the way they're treating you, then what thoughts are you having? Are you holding the story in place that they are horrible or abrupt or don't respect, value, appreciate or love you or whatever? Okay, change your inner world and the outside world has to reflect it back to you because it is a mirror. So when you change within the outside world will change and reflect it back to you. If it, Even if it's a situation, okay, you can change the outcome here. So have an amazing birthday, love and light.